Phillies hosting the Mariners, and the Mariners are minus 105 on the money line. The Phillies are minus 115. The over-under is 8.5 runs. The Mariners, getting a run and a half on the run line, are minus 205, while the Phillies, laying a run and a half on the run line, are plus 170. Kirby did not pitch against the Phillies last year, and Strauman did, or Strom, forgive me, did pitch against the Mariners last year. All of the games were in relief. Two-thirds of an inning, no runs, no earn. They won that game 12. Six, one inning, no runs, no earn. They won that game 7-3. One inning, one run, one earn. They won 4-3, and that was in Seattle. A third of an inning, no runs, no earn. They lost that game 7-6, and that was also in Seattle. Head-to-head, the road team is 7-3. The underdog is on a seven-game winning streak. The underdog is 8-2 on the money line. The underdog getting a run and a half on the run line is 9-1. There have been four one-run games in their last ten meetings, two out of their last four, and the game that they played today. The over is 6-2-2 two, two in their last 10. The over 8.5 runs is 8-2. And, and the Phillies are 6-4 and four in their last 10 games against the Mariners. Now, the game that they played today, the Phillies won 6-5. And the game before that, the Mariners won 5-3. Those are the games that they played against each other this year. Now, in their last handful of games overall, the Mariners are 2-2 two and two in their last four, uh, four games. And they are 5-5 five and five in their last 10. We've had 9 runs, 10 runs, 8 runs, and 11 runs. They scored 5 runs and a win, 3 runs and a loss, 5 runs and a win, 5 runs and a loss. So 5 seems to be the magic number that they've been scoring lately. For the Phillies, they are 7-3 and three in their last 10. They've won 4 out of their last 5 games. They're 3-1 and one in their last 4. We've had 7 runs, 12 runs, 8 runs, and 11 runs. 4 runs and a win, 9 runs and a win, 3 runs and a loss, and 6 runs in a win. I'm going to go with the road team stat here. I liked the Phillies as the home under today, but I'm going to go with the Mariners for tomorrow. I just think that the underdog stat and the road team stat are just nothing to sneeze at. So I'm going to take Seattle with the money line. I'm going to take Seattle getting the runs, and I'm going to go over in this game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.